My name is Sota Kagishima. I'm a lonely nerd and a second year high school student. I'm not good at dealing with people, so I spend most of my time reading a book at the corner of my classroom. Despite that, I have someone I admire. Here comes the ice queen. She sure is pretty as always. Her name is Rina Byakuga. She has good grades, capable at doing sports, and a perfect head of student council. But she has a strange rumor. It is said that she was a former leader of Yankees. She defeated a bear with bare hands. She also beat a hundred people. She destroyed a nasty gang all by herself and so on. I just can't believe those rumors since she looks so pretty. But it seems that it's because of her attitude. Byakuga-san, I think I am in... That's impossible. Byakuga-san, if you don't mind, would you go home together with... No way. Byakuga-san, you look beautiful. You don't have to sweet talk me. Jeez, she's ignoring them all at once again today. Byakuga-san is famous for being unfriendly and cold. Because of that, she looks scary. Maybe that was the reason why we heard the rumor about her being the former leader of Yankees. It's a common thing to be hated for acting like that, but... The case is different for Byakuga-san. She's awesome as always! I want her to act cold to me! Those cold words she said were the best! Um... Seems like they are making things to go worse. Most people praise her for her cold attitude. They demand her to act cold. I've even heard some voices saying that they want her to kick them out. She is a perfect head of student council despite of her cold attitude. I'm one of her fans, but I don't think I can get closer to her anyway. Although we're in the same class, most of the time, Byakuga-san only talks to girls. She will just cut me off if I get closer to her. That's why I'm satisfied just by looking at her from a distance. I can't stand being cut off if I get closer to her, but I want to get along well with her. I know that it's a dream, but someday, I wish that I could talk to her even for once. I was spending my days while thinking about that. One day at the lunch break, something happens. Hey. Huh? Uh, Byakuga-san, what's wrong? Can I have a moment with you? Uh, oh, yeah, sure. Well, can you meet me later? Huh? Why did she ask me to meet her? What did I do to her? I don't think I did something nasty. I have something to discuss with you. Uh, um... What? Are you saying that you're not coming? No, it's not that, but... Well then, just come. Uh, oh. Say it clearly. Are you coming or not? I'm coming. Yikes, that was scary. I'm toast. I can't believe that the head of student council just asked him directly. God bless them. Man, I think he's toast. Why isn't anyone helping me? I was invited by Byakuga-san to come to the roof floor. I wonder what she wants to discuss with me. I don't recall I've done something wrong. By any chance, is she going to beat me just because she hates me? I think today will be my last day of being alive. Soda-kun. Yikes! Oh, oh, please spare my life. I love you. Huh? I'm in love with you deeply. What? No way! Byakuga-san is in love with me? Is this some kind of trick or practical joke? I think I heard the wrong words. Hey, are you listening? Uh, oh, yeah, I'm listening. So, what's your answer? That's... I'm telling you to make a decision. Are you going to be in a relationship with me or not? Yikes! It would be a great pleasure for me to be in a relationship with you. Oh, well, I'm counting on you from now. I ended up starting a relationship with Byakuga-san. The next day, I didn't expect that I could be in a relationship with Byakuga-san. Is this a dream? I think it's a dream. I was so happy that I keep smiling from early morning. Oh, it's Byakuga-san. I don't usually greet her, but since we're in a relationship, I think I should greet her. Byakuga-san, good morning. Don't speak to me. Huh? <laughs> no way. I didn't give up dealing with Byakuga-san's cold attitude, so I decided to talk to her, but she ignored me. In addition, she also went somewhere during the lunch break. Although we're in a relationship, I don't think anything between us has changed. I thought she's in a relationship with me. There's no doubt that what happened yesterday might be a dream. Well, I think so. After all, I'm only a nerd, and I don't think I'm the proper guy for her. We haven't done anything most couples do, but 
Several days have passed by. During that period, I was shocked that I couldn't concentrate studying at school. I know it can't be helped, but it seems that the shock was beyond my imagination. I didn't expect to get a bad grade at this mini test. I shouldn't have done that. I need to study more to fix my mistakes. Jeez, I think I'm not capable of doing anything. Since it's useless to just continue whining, I'll do my best. Hmm, I think this part should be... Um... Huh? I think someone is coming, but... I wonder why that person chose the place beside me. There are a lot vacant places around. Anyway, I wonder who this person is. Huh? Bikuga-san? What? Why are you here? That's because I heard that you went to the library. What are you doing? Oh, uh... I took a bad grade at the mini-test last time. I understood the parts where I made mistakes, so... I was thinking to study more. I see. Keep on the good work. Anyway, will you be angry if I talk to you? Huh? What are you talking about all of a sudden? Well, whenever I tried to talk to you, you just ignored me. Sorry. Huh? I was just shy. Whenever you talked to me, I was so happy that I began to smile. That's why I ignored you in front of our classmates. I'm really sorry for that. So that was the reason why? The... that's so cute. As a token of my apology, let me help you with your study. What? Are you sure? I'm glad to hear that. Thanks! Well then, let's start. It was easy to understand. I think I can handle this. Thanks, Byakuga-san! Anyway... Huh? When there's no people around us, I can do what I did just now. So, I want to meet you with no people around at school from now on. Do you mind? Uh, of course not. Well then, let's meet each other secretly. Since then, I've been meeting Byakuga-san secretly. She's acting cold when there are people around us, but when there's just the two of us, she changed her attitude. We hold hands, lean on each other, and so on. We're doing a light skinship to get closer to each other. She acts totally different when we're together, so I think that the gap is really cute. I get attracted to her day by day. One day, a date? Yeah, we haven't go somewhere together yet. So I was wondering if you want to go for a date next holiday. Additionally, if we are out of school, we can spend more time together. But if you're busy, we can do it next time. No problem. Let's go on a date. Really? I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> Glad to hear that. Well, let's meet each other at the park then. Sure. Then, the expected holiday came quickly. I was so nervous that I've arrived here too early. Oh, Soda-kun, you're here already. Sorry to have kept you waiting. Never mind. What's wrong? So cute. Huh? Very cute. Oh, thanks. You look great too. Well, let's go then. We went to the cafe, amusement center, and karaoke. Both me and Byakuga-san enjoyed our date. I had a lot of fun. Thanks for getting this for me. I didn't expect that you could get this big stuff thing. There's a trick for that. Actually... Ouch! That's hurt. I'm sorry, are you alright? It hurts. I think my arm is broken. You must pay for the compensation! What? I... I don't think I... Just leave your wallet and get lost. If you don't, you'll experience pain. Yikes! Wait, you shouldn't hurt my precious person. Huh? What's with this girl? Don't you dare to act big! byakuga san Huh? What? You were trying to hurt someone all of a sudden. You really have no common sense at all. Huh? This girl... My hand! You were the one who started first. Be prepared then! You are nothing to me! She's a girl, but why is she so strong? That sharp eyes! I remember you! You are Rena, the lofty apex! The strongest leader of Yankees! Shut up! What's with that? Do you want me to teach you common sense? Yikes! I'm sorry! So, the rumor was true. She was a Yankee. Oh, uh, I was losing control of myself. Sorry that I frightened you. I'm really sorry. Byakuga-san. From the next day, 
I couldn't contact Byakuga-san. Although I go to school, I can't get a chance to be together with her. I tried to talk to her, but she just ignored me. Are we going to end our relationship without talking to each other? Does that mean that I can't be together with Byakuga-san anymore? I can't stand that. I will just... Byakuga-san. Oh, Soda-kun. Huh? Wait, Byakuga-san. Why are you ignoring me? Do you hate me? No. I was scared. You found out that I was a former Yankee. The true me is not elegant at all. There's no doubt that you will be disappointed at me. I don't want you to hate me since I love you so much. That's why I... I'm not disappointed at you at all. Because I'm deeply in love with you. Are you sure? Even though I was a Yankee? I don't care about that. It's because I love you just the way you are. I... I'm glad to hear that. Anyway, can I know why do you love me? Actually... When I was a Yankee, you helped me. Huh? By any chance? I was helping a girl who got involved at a traffic accident. I didn't know that it was you. From that time, I've been in love with you. So, that's why I'm so happy now. We ended up keeping our relationship. Byakuga-san acts cold as always. She's dealing coldly with those who talk to her. But, one thing has changed. Soda-kun, morning. Good morning, Byakuga-san. You look cool as always. You also look cute, Byakuga-san. <laughs> Thanks. She is now able to show her shy part in front of other people. Since she has lost her cold attitude, I thought that her fans have decreased, but because of that gap, her fans have increased. But Byakuga-san is loyal to me. She told everyone that all she could see is me. Everyone has various past lives. No matter what the past life is, if the person is the one you love, you can accept that. That's why I will love her just the way she is. It's because she's adorable and cute. <laughs>